guys so in last video we have done accuracy visualization so let's move forward to model testing let's open google collab and create a new notebook i am renaming it to testing model okay so this is our testing model and let's comment out with importing libraries and we need numpy so import numpy as np and we need second one is tensorflow as tf and third one for visualization import matplotlib dot pyplot as plt so we have successfully imported our library now let's connect to google drive because our data set is in google drive so write a piece of code from google dot collab we have to import drive and then in drive dot mount use mount and mount pass a path where we have our drive so pass here content slash drive okay let's run this so it's after running it will ask for access give you access to google account okay so we got access okay now we will see here google drive we refresh it yeah here we got drive so in drive we have my drive and in my drive this one we have uh, this fruit vegetable recognition data set in which now i am going to test my model so I will use the image of this test set to test our model. Okay. We have already trained our model on training set and validation set. Now we are going to test our model. So I am going to use this test directory. And in test directory we have a lot of apple image, banana image. So we are going to take a random image and perform a single prediction. Now we got access with our data set. Next step is to load our model we use a h2 heading so right here loading model so this is our uh, train model which we created in last videos okay so if you're new to this video then please watch this playlist from beginning in our previous videos we have done this so this is our cnn model which we build so here we have saved this model so we are going to use this trained model.h5 file to perform our prediction okay for that we have to upload that model to upload that model i already saved that model so upload that model from here this is our train model.h5 file so upload this model so its model is uploading so let's create here cnn variable cnn and in cnn we have to load that model so use tensorflow in tensorflow use go to keras and in keras go to models and in models go to load model and in load model just pass the name of this this complete thing just pass the path of this one okay so pass here this this model path and when you execute this code then cnn model will be loaded this model will be loaded in this variable cnn okay still model is uploading to google collab so after upload we are going to run this cell okay here model is successfully uploaded now let's run this cell so we have successfully loaded our model now we are interested in single prediction okay let's write here performing 
prediction on single image okay performing prediction on single image so we need one single image so first of all let's do visualization so let's write here visualization and performing prediction on single image okay so first of all we have to visualize on which image we are going to perform our single prediction so import cv2 for visualization and we have to create our image path so let's write here image path is equal to now we have to pass the path of the image so take from here so i am interested in test folder in test folder i am interested in this apple so let's take this image this is the image of apple so i'm going to use this image so copy the path from here and just paste here now we have to read this image so to read this image create one variable img and in img use cv2.imread and in this pass image path okay pass image path and just write here plt dot im show and in this pass image this image okay and now let's run this if you run this then you will get this image this image path okay now we have to give a title also so give the title of this um, plot so title is this is our test image and we don't need this x and y axis so right here plt dot x sticks x sticks and pass a empty list and use plt dot y ticks pass empty list and do plt dot show if you run this then you will get this good visualization of this single image okay so we got this test image now we are going to use the cnn model to do prediction and at last we will see whether our model is predicting right or not whether it's predicting that it's a apple or not so that's all for this video in this video we have learned what library we need and we successfully loaded our model and we also perform visualization of single image which we are going to use for prediction so in next video we are going to test this model we are going to perform some pre-processing overall this model is trained on on this parameters these are the parameters which are used pre-process this image after pre-processing the image that image is passed to this model for the training okay so model is trained on this parameter of image so for prediction also this model will accept only that type of image which we have trained in previous okay so we have to pre-process this image in the same format which we have used for training purpose okay so in next video we will do test image pre-processing and then we will pass it to the cnn model so that's all for this video we will meet in next video thank you guys thanks a lot for watching this video Bye.